Hey Blockchain Heroes fans, Blockchain Cards here. Chris, I thought I would do a quick video for my sanity and for historical purposes. So I have some documentation of these test sample cards for Blockchain Heroes project. Uh, this was the very first uh, set of samples that we made of Metagame. Uh, this is a base card and we had test sample uh, hugely, <laughs> hugely uh, large on there as far as the text. Uh, the backs had the dark gray borders, and we'll get into more about that in a second. And uh, its partner was the test of the hologram, and that's on the base image. Uh, I suggested to Travis um, we should do some of the holograms extending the borders all out. And once, uh, you know, they we did a test of that, which is going to be, I'm going to show you guys right now. Um, they went with that kind of design, so that was a, a good call for them to uh, to do that. But anyways, these are the two originals with the backs, as you can see here. Actually, do these backs are? Oh, funny. Um, I guess it wouldn't it wouldn't matter, but um, orientation is everything sometimes. So when you flip it, as you can see, they're 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 not they're they're opposites. Um, some card collectors like to be flipping like this, while some card collectors flip like that. Um, and it's basically this one's going to be the opposite. This one will probably be upside down when you do that. Yeah, see. So orientation is everything sometimes with these backs of these cards, and it really honestly doesn't really matter because you can just flip it this way. But um, that's kind of just a fun little kind of anecdote here. And as you can see here, uh, also a note: I did different thicknesses of the backs of the cards too. As you can see here, the border for this one is a little thinner than this one. There's lots of tests that we do uh, during the process to kind of find out the exact things that uh, look good as far as border widths and, and, and bleeds and things like that when it comes to card production. Um, so let's get into the new cards. That's what I want to do this video about. Uh, first up, we have this Genesis test sample for the Titan deck. This is a holographic, and like I said before, uh, I suggested that they, they make a borderless card for the Titan decks, and, and these came out really, really cool, as we can see here, with the holographic feel to it. And of course, anytime you shine it in different ways, uh, you're going to get that other different rainbow effects. Of course, the, the, the dark colors, the blacks, aren't going to show as well as the lighter colors are going to pick up that light refractor spectrum. As you can see, there's a full rainbow effect here. Um, these ones had the light gray backgrounds, which were the files were provided, as you can see, and, and we'll show you in a second. There's three, three different colors of gray, so we'll have to lock that down uh, before production to figure out which ones the guys want. Uh, so that's what the Genesis looks like, and this is what the Wizard looks like. I thought this came out really, really cool, uh, the way the light kind of just bursts out of the Wizard. And this is what the back looks like. Uh, another test sample back with all the information. The backs really pop really well. They really did a really good, the artist did an amazing job uh, with the backs. These, these look absolutely amazing, uh, along with the artistry in the front. But anyways, these are the Titan Deck cards. I guess we can show them side by side. No borders, and I think that whole, the whole no borders looks just super amazing. Uh, real quick, we'll show you the base cards. We'll start with uh, the base deck. And we can see here the test sample of the wizard with the white border and the gray back. And I think the base cards are really nice. They don't have like, you know, the the shimmer and everything of the hollows, but you can really see the artwork. And the artwork really looks amazing for the for the base cards. As you can see here, this is what they look like side by side. Uh, you could see that, you know, there's a wow factor with this. Oh my God, it's shiny. But there's also the wow factor when it comes to just the beautiful artwork that was created for each one of these characters. Uh, here's the test sample of the Genesis base. As we can see here, it looks really good. And I think the holographic refractor art lend itself very well to that. But... You know, as you can see here, the base card looks amazing too because it really shows all the original art created uh, for this particular character. As you can see here, another test sample back. That's what it looks like. I did make a couple things for fun because we usually have some some space to do extra fun cards. 
Uh, I did a holographic examples of the bases just to see what they would look like because that's what we do when we do a production run. We, I kind of have some extra space to put in some extra stuff and with that I'll do some tests just to see what just to see what it looks like. It's mostly for my personal amusement because you never know what's you know something like oh my you know if I do it some way it looks a lot better than another way and it's just good to have examples of different works that we've done so that you know in the future uh, we can definitely see what works and what doesn't and I thought that was really cool. So this is not a production card this is just for my own personal like I said amusement of what a base hologram would look like kind of similar to what we did with uh, metagame here kind of same example and that, I guess that could be a standalone set all in itself uh, here's what the base one of the wizard looks like holographic base these are not production cards by the way uh, another thing that's not a production card that I thought would be fun to make is non holographic burst Titan cards as you can see here they're non holographic and it, the colors really pop uh, really well too and I can show you um, what two of the the cards this is like production piece right here hologram and this is a non-production you know sample for fun just to see what it look would look like um, I found it interesting that there was actually three different types of gray backgrounds uh, with these when everything was said and done but this is what they look like uh, really excited these sold out in literally minutes so we're very excited uh, to release these to everyone um, not sure exactly when these are going to come out, though we're saying September could be later with production and everything that's going on in the world. You never know when, you know, certain things are going to be delayed and we just want everyone to, to just be patient and these cards will get in everyone's hands. Uh, I guess I kind of, I, I can guess I could show you a little bit of also a sneak preview of the box of these what they come in what they're going to come in as you can see here these will be all sealed and all the cards will be uh, sitting there it's got a little top and uh, there'll be some artwork a sticker on the front everything will be sealed in here um, your NFT and everything will be will be put in there and I guess I can stick some cards in here just to show you what it would look like because that's kind of fun oops this will hold the whole set and this will be sealed up just like this and that's what it'll look like and then everything will be ready to either keep sealed and my phone's going off of course right at the end of this video like like natural but anyways i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna go answer this phone and uh let me know what you think and we'll see you next time take care